In this tutorial, I will show you how to buy and install WordPress on Cloudways step by step. Where I will show you which hosting plan you should choose and the actual buying process involved. I will then show you how to install WordPress on Cloudways the right way and choosing the correct settings. Towards the end of this video, I will give you a very special offer if you decide to pick up Cloudways through my link below. I will give you my six figure blogger course for free as a way of saying thank you for supporting my channel. Now let's get started. Step one, click on the link in the description or type this into your browser. It'll take you to my special Cloudways discount page where you will get the best discount Cloudways is currently offering by using my special coupon code, which I will show you in just a moment. I also provide you with my six figure blogger course for free as a way of saying thank you for supporting the channel. And from here, we can click on get started. And here's the Cloudways pricing page. As you probably already know, Cloudway is a managed cloud hosting platform where they use cloud servers from places like DigitalOcean, Linode, Vulture, AWS, and Google Cloud and put that to use through their tools. So this essentially allows you to manage your websites easier with Cloudways dashboard, as opposed to one of these cloud servers. So there are five different cloud servers for you to choose from, and they all range in different prices and resources. So it depends on what you're looking to go for. If you want the high end, it's gonna be the Amazon AWS and Google Cloud, which starts at over $30 a month. But if you're just getting started, then I don't think you really need this at all. You can start with any of these three from DigitalOcean, Linode, and Vulture. But the plan that I believe will get you the most bang for your buck will be the Vulture server and selecting the high frequency server. So this one will start at $13 per month. It's not as cheap as the cheapest one, which is $10 per month. But for the extra $3, I think it's worth it when it comes to performance that you get. And just a quick note on some of the features that you'll get with Cloudways, the first being just your standard SSL certificate and your 24 seven customer support. And some unique features of their plans is that you're on a monthly plan and you're not locked in. You only have to pay for the resources that you use each month. So if you use less, you pay less. If you use more, you pay more. And if you wanna cancel, you can do that at any time. You're not locked in on a one year, two year, three year contract like many other hosting providers. So I think this is a really good thing. Another unique feature is their free website migration. If you need to migrate your first website, then Cloudways team will do this for you personally without you having to touch a button. So this is also really handy for someone moving over from another hosting provider. Cloudways also has their own CDN and they have server side caching, which is meant to be faster than any free or paid caching plugin. So now you'll need to decide on which plan you wanna start with. But just a quick note with the bandwidth, you can see here their lowest plan gives you one terabyte. And if you compare this to other managed WordPress hosting providers, one terabyte is gonna be around 800,000 visits per month. So I don't think you're worrying about the bandwidth here. It's just more the speed. So the RAM and the processor, how fast you want that for your website. If you got more of a budget, then you can start higher. But if you don't, it's okay as well. You can start from the basic plan and you can always upgrade later. As I said, it's month by month, so it's very flexible. And right now, I'll just choose the basic one and click on start free. So now we want to enter in our details. And the next thing is where you enter in the special promo code that I have for you. So you click on here and then you type in Alan Borch. And now it gives you this tick, which means the coupon code has been applied. And now you'll get an extra discount for your hosting with Cloudways. Now click on I agree and then start free. So now we're on Cloudway's dashboard. And with every new account, Cloudway gives you a three day trial. But what you first have to do before you can create and spin up your first server is to verify your email by going to your email address. And if you don't get an email, then you just quickly have to click here to resend. And from my email account, this is the email that I received. And all I have to do is click on activate account. And that's it. Now it says, thank you for your verification. My email has been verified and I'm ready to go to the next step. The next step is to create and install our WordPress website with Cloudways. You wanna pick what you want to install. We wanna choose the name of our app and our server. 
The next step is to choose which cloud server you want. But like I said, for this tutorial, I'll choose Vulture and I'll select the high frequency one. And I'll just start off with the one gigabyte. That should be enough for a brand new website. And we come down to the bottom and for the location, we can choose from so many different locations around the world. So this depends on where most of your traffic is coming from. So for example, if you live in Australia and most of your visitors are from Australia, then you would probably pick Sydney. But if you have a global website where your customers are worldwide, then you probably want to pick somewhere in the USA. And for this one, I'll pick New York. And once we're happy with everything, you can click on launch now. Now we need to give Cloudways a few minutes to spin up this server for us. It says here it takes 13 minutes, but usually it'll be less than five minutes and we'll come back when it's ready. Now that our server is ready, we're ready to move on to the next step. And that is to connect your domain name to Cloudways. Cloudways does not allow you to buy domain names through them. So the domain name provider that I use and I recommend to you also is Namecheap. And if you want help to buy your domain name from Namecheap, I have this video for you that will guide you through everything step by step. So now we will click on applications and then click on our server. Click on domain management. Now we will type in the domain name that we will be connecting. Now click on save changes. And the next step is to click back onto servers, select our server, and now under master credentials, you'll see public IP. We wanna copy this, and now we will go to our Namecheap domain account. Under the domain name you want, you wanna select advanced DNS. Now we wanna click on add new record, choose a record, and for the host, just type in the at symbol. And for the value, we'll paste in the value that we copied from Cloudways before. And once that's done, just click on save. One more thing we want to do is click on add new record. This time it will be a C name and the host will be www and the value will be the, our domain name. This is to point all www.allenborch.com to our original allenborch.com. Once we have done that, we're ready to move on to the next step. We still have another step to go, but I just wanted to ask if you're getting value out of my videos so far. If so, make sure to like my video and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on more quality content like this that I release every single week. The next step is to install our SSL certificate on our website. And to do that, we once again click on applications, click into our server, click on SSL certificate. Now we wanna type in our email address and our domain name and click on install certificate. Give it a second for Cloudway to install this for you. Now the next step we need to do is to enable HTTPS. This means that it will 301 redirect all unsaved pages to a secured HTTPS format. So we click on enable HTTPS. And that's done, so we can close it now. Now we wanna go and check and see if our WordPress installation and SSL certificate has been done correctly. And to access our WordPress dashboard, we can go to access details, click on admin panel, and under admin panel, click here. That will take you to the login page. So now you need to copy your username and your password. I'll just click on that to copy my password and type it into here. Now click on login. Now you can see here my WordPress dashboard is working correctly. And if I go to the top and click on the lock icon, you can see the connection is secured that means my SSL certificate has also been installed correctly. Now one more thing, let's see what it looks like from the front end. So we click on visit site and you can see the lock is on still and the front end of the website works. So that means our first two step of installing the WordPress and SSL certificate has been done correctly. Now the next step is usually to set up our email accounts. But in this case, Cloudways does not offer this for free. So you would have to find another provider to host your emails. This is not ideal for a newbie, but for most people doing it for a while, probably have their email hosted elsewhere anyway. Like me, for example, I have all my emails hosted on G Suite. But G Suite can be quite expensive, as you can see here. It's gonna cost you at least $6 per month, which is half the price of your hosting already. There are other solutions out there on the market that gives you a free hosting. So I recommend you check out Zoho Mail, as I used this years ago when I first started and it doesn't cost you a dollar. It's nowhere near as good as G Suite, but it'll get you started if that's the option that you wanna take. So 
So the next step I will show you instead is how to optimize your website to increase your speed. So we will do this by installing Redis Cache for Cloudways, which is what they recommend. And if you need a more in-depth guide or understanding of what this is, then you can come to this article. So what we do is to click on settings and package, then click on packages, and then click on install Redis. The next step is to install WPCF editor. And we go to plugins and click on add new, type in WPCF editor, click on install now, activate. Now we wanna hover over here and click on raw editing. And now from our instruction, it's saying to copy this and paste it right under the first line. So we'll do that now. But you can see here, it's already there. So we do not have to do that part. And now the second part is to copy this and paste it here. So now we go back and this is where we should paste it in. So you just hit enter and then paste that in there. Once we have done that, you wanna to scroll to the very bottom and click on save. And yes, we want to update. And that's it, we're done. So the next step is to install our Redis object cache. To do this, we'll go back to our WordPress dashboard, go to plugins, click on add new, and type in Redis. And it should be this first one here. We click on install now and activate. And now we can go to our settings and you can see here, there's a new tab called Redis. Click on that. And now we want to enable the object cache. This is very important to activate this. And now you'll see that once I click it, the status will change to connected. The next step in optimizing your website is to install your CDN. And there's normally the free option of using Cloudflare. However, Cloudway does have their own recommended CDN. So I'm gonna use their recommended one instead. And to do this, we'll click on Cloudway CDN from our application section. And you can see here, it says we have to upgrade first before we can use their CDN. So I'm gonna put down my credit card details and upgrade now. There's our confirmed upgrade. So now I will refresh this page. Now you can see our CDN is ready to be installed. So we just type in our website name and then click on create. And that's it, our CDN has been successfully installed. Just a quick note regarding my bonus offer to you. If you decide to pick up Cloudways through my link below, just simply send me your full receipt to bonus at .com and I will send you access to my bonus course right away. It's that simple. Now that you have successfully installed WordPress onto your bare bones Cloudways account, it's time to go out and fully build out your actual website. And this next video will help you do just that. So check it out and I'll see you in that next tutorial.